Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Dactron here, and I'm back with another video. And as you can see, it is finally time. I'm going to be covering Injustice 2 on the channel, and uh, I cannot be more ecstatic. So, uh, as you can imagine, um, I'm going to cover a lot of this game. So, we're going to start off real simple. We're going to start off with the story. Then we're going to do some uh, multiverse stuff. And uh, those will be the two things we do mainly. And then we might do some battles, DLC and stuff come out. And I'll cover some of that. So, yeah. Um, we'll go ahead and we'll get rolling with the main story here though. As um, this will be the second time I play through. I'm already played through once at this point, And I'm so excited. Uh, yeah, go ahead. And then uh, we'll be doing medium with subtitles on. And I'm going to tell you this now, uh, playing through this with the first time, there were a lot of deaths, a lot of deaths. So hopefully the second time, we can be a little better and try to die a little less. You know, important stuff. Netherrealm Studios game. Run! Uh, maybe not to it though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi. Oh. Wow. Those guys are taking them apart. It's like the military, I think. Brainiac ship. They're coming for you, Kara. Get you booty up. Run. Don't look back. Just run. And now everything's fine. I don't know about you, but I'd keep running. I don't want to be caught out here. Especially with those little metal men running around. They have no heart. Little tin men. Wow. Candor sure taking a beating. Come on, Scully. down the whole city. Yeah, wow. That's, that's a good expression. Hey, Kara. There's a dude behind you. Up, Kara. Mama kind of looks old. Doesn't look like she can defend everything. Stay with me, Kara. The ship it just Argo City's gone. Millions of people. That's only the beginning. Brainiacs destabilized the planet's core. Krypton won't hold together much longer. But all your research, isn't there something you can do? That's why we're here. A spaceship. That's what you've been working on. Your uncle Jor-El discovered a planet that can sustain Kryptonians far away from Brainiac. He's built a ship just like this for your cousin Cal. But Cal, he's just a baby. Which is why you'll need to protect him. Teach him our ways. We teach him. What about you? No. No. No, I won't leave you. Please. Please don't make me. 
I don't think there's much of a choice. I think you gotta go. But you'll never be alone. You belong to the house of El Kara, a house of hope. Yeah, never house of hope. Forget that. Never give up hope. Never. Get in. Mom. I'm behind you. Oh. So in this universe, uh, actually, Brainiac is the cause of Krypton. Uh, Krypton's destabilization and its explosion, so I think that's unique just alone. Aww, little cows are sleeping. Kaboom! Are there any seatbelts on this thing? In my years fighting crime, I've learned one truth. That every villain is the hero of his own story. Superman was no exception. The Joker drugged him, tricked him into killing his pregnant wife Lois, and made him trigger the bomb that nuked Metropolis. So when Superman killed the Joker, I understood why. We all did. But once that line was crossed, there was no going there back. There was no going back. He gave himself and the Justice League a new mandate. Stop all crime before it happened, by any means necessary. But he couldn't see his good intentions were leading him down a path of tyranny and evil. That's how our greatest hero became our greatest threat. It's very true. So one of Superman's pulling criminals out of Arkham. They're the worst of the worst. He's going to kill them, Damien. Sounds like justice to me. Killing people is injustice. Superman can't see that. He's grieving. He needs time to heal. Yeah, and what if it had been Gotham? If Joker had killed me, your own son, yeah, well, he tries not to think like that. It's not responding. We're being taken to the back cave. Prepare to eject. Here we go. It's a Wayne Enterprise building. Cyborg himself. Idiot. Huh. A warning shot, Cyborg. I won't hurt you unless I have to. You're gonna have to. My friends were in Metropolis, Batman. Starfire, Beast Boy. The Titans. We do this. That never happens again. I You're thought right that uh, the Titans were locked That's in the Phantom Zone for some reason. And the Justice League isn't the Death Squad. Come on, Cyborg. Oh, a little late. Punch Falcon being angry isn't enough. Going up. So, uh, something I want to go ahead and tell you is, uh, Batman might have had the best redesign for, um, Injustice 2. He is one of the most fluent characters you could play as, and literally. I, I kid you not, in the first game, I considered him almost unplayable. You don't see it yet, but Superman's wrong. Your glider skills need work. 
Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks for asking. Let's go. Uh, Damien, Damien, Damien. The only reason I kind of like Damien in this game is it might mean that I get Nightwing in this game at some point. Aww. Little Joe didn't see anything happen. But he saw the foot. And that foot. In the ground. Better angle. Uh, that's a little excessive, Bruce. So you won't kill, but you're fine with traumatic brain injuries. Secure the loading. Yeah, it's fine. Who cares? Traumatic brain injuries or not. Oh, great. Here to help, Bruce? Yes, to keep you and Clark from making a terrible mistake. None no, they're going to make a mistake. This, Trust something the tells me. Forced our hand. Metropolis changed the world. Now we have to change with it. Not like this. Yeah, of not like people, this. I, I agree. Thought you would understand. Hail Hermes. Oh. Oh, come on, Wonder Woman. Get down here. Battering. Don't waste my time. Uh huh. You're trash. I guess I'm signed? Question mark. Kick. Come on. You're not Captain America. Ah, uh, sidekick. Ready to lose your head? Don't bet on it. Kick. It's over, Diana. Yeah, Diana. It's Come over. On. I need you to tell me the truth. Where is he? Where's Rachel? Cell block C. Oh. You can't turn your back on him. He needs you. That's why I came. Wow. Um, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Uh, he does not look like a friendly. So, I'd put him down. inmates are irredeemable they're thieves rapists murderers like the joker that's the problem with fighting for truth and justice the battle never ends and executing them will end it first joker now this when does it stop when there's no more crime when people can live without fear we want the same thing bruce i wanted to kill my parents murderer i could have but that's not the life they wanted for me and it's not the life Lois would want for you. Don't you put that on me. Well, he put it on you, and it's a very true statement. A red solar grenade. To dull your powers, you need to stop. Take time to grieve before it's too late. You wouldn't... 
I would. You're supposed to be my friend, which is why I have to stop you. Time to go. To dull his powers. I need to see what he's like fully charged then. So as always, Superman and Batman come to blows by the, the uh, time they actually try to do something. Anytime they're together, they just... It's always on borrowed time, you know, that at some point they're going to come into blows with one another. Punch! Don't waste my time. Oh! That was pretty good. Got him. Oh yeah. You're going down. 1989 reference. That'll hurt. It's a good time to mention I played as Batman a little bit. Headbutt. I'm sorry, Clark. Get away from me. Look who I found. Victor Sass. Psychopath. How many women have you killed? <laughs> Hundred. Twenty-one. A hundred and twenty-one. Huh. Sounds incorrigible to me. Robin, let him go! You'd rather fight Damian, your friends no. than the real problem. I'm warning you, son. Warn him. Son? You didn't raise me. The League of Assassins did. <laughs> oh, wow. Problem solved. Who's next? Damn it, Damien! This is a line we do not cross. Then stay on your side, Batman. I'll be on Superman's. You ungrateful little twerk. Get down here. Come on, dork. I, mean, I know what to stay away from. Come on. Oh, crap. I didn't realize how far down I was. Uh, of course. I've never needed you. Kick. Go. I'm gonna lose. No, I refuse. Thank you. Unusually sloppy, Damien. I had no problem at the first time I did this one. I'm in the head on that one. Hopefully, this finishes him. This gets me closer. I don't know how Damien's gonna survive all these guns. Apparently that's just me though. Crap! Ugh. This is a bad start to the series. I'll be on Superman's. Kick. Other kick. There we go. Stay down, dork.
course, they dispatch Superman like it's nothing. I've kicked ass from day one. Don't be so sure. Yeah, don't be so sure. Kick. Stay down. Damien. I. Uh, I never meant to. You coward. We are at war with these animals. You think you're better than him? You let the Joker keep on killing. You couldn't save Lois or Jason or anyone. That's enough. Let's go. But the inmates. Not today. Bye, Dork. <sighs> and at that moment in time, we knew that Damian Wayne had officially turned to the dark side. It's been years since the regime fell. Superman's behind bars. Damian, my own son, is there with him. But we can't ever forget why we put them there. We must stay vigilant. I thought your goal was to reassure people, Mr. Wayne. You're not alone in rebuilding Gotham and Metropolis. But if we don't change some minds soon... Thought that's why you hired that overpaid PR firm, Lucius. Convincing folks to move back to these cities is a lot harder when they're afraid someone's gonna knock them down again. I can Superman's understand never that. Getting out. I made that clear. But Wonder Woman, Black Adam, Aquaman, they're still out there somewhere. And seemingly immune to prosecution. I know you built Brother Eye to keep tabs on all those loose ends, but the public doesn't know. Brother Eye's secrecy is critical. Our enemies can't fight something they don't know exists. Well, then at least follow one bit of advice we paid those PR people so much money for. What's that? What's that? Be a little less Batman, a little more billionaire playboy. Get out around town in the daylight. And smile. Focus groups show people feel safer when they see you smile. Hmm. That would be your other job. Yeah, well, Bruce, got so many jobs to circle. Your circle of trust. Nobody wins all by themselves. Not even you. Yeah, well. As a reception area, this place needs a lot of work. Dinah, Oliver, thanks for coming on short notice. You're lucky we found a sitter. Nice. Come on down, kids. My great-grandfather built the original Gotham Underground. But these days, it's the Batcave. Looks spiffy. And this is Brother Eye. More like the Eye of Sauron. Surveillance hub? More than that. A communications hub. Linking every satellite and server on the planet. It warns us when trouble's coming. And guides us when trouble's here. Must take a real genius to operate. I don't know about genius. But I do got a PhD. <laughs> Dinah! Dinah's hubby! You sure came a long way. A world away. But the change of scenery is nice. I was surprised you called. I hate Oliver. Things seem to be going well. So in what's this game, up? I just don't like it. Dismantling the regime created gaps in global security. We're covering them where we can. But we're stretched thin, vulnerable. Harleen, show them what you found. Right oh bats. Oh yeah. Gorilla Grodd. Everyone's favorite talking ape. He's got himself a band of bozos. Calls them the society. Love band of My bozos. My mole in Gorilla City says Grodd's planning something big. But what, where, when, we don't know. One thing we do know. Scarecrow's gonna ship Grodd a buttload of fear gas from a hideout in Slaughter Swamp. Very mosquito-y. 
Good thing I packed my bug spray. I need you three to stop that huh. gas before it gets to Grodd. Not joining us for the party? Unfortunately, I can't leave Gotham without worrying the public. Don't worry, Bet. With this crew on the job, what could go wrong? A lot. I know I'm the new guy, but you really trust Harley? She's a different person since Joker died. Mostly. Huh. I like the view. All right, and uh, as you can imagine, that's going to do it for this one. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you'll stick around. We've got a long way to go in the story, and I'm so excited. As you can see, the story's a little more talking than it is uh, fighting. So I get to chime in every once in a while with joyous commentary while the voice actors do their craft. So uh, like I said, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. It all goes a long way. Follow me on Twitter if you get an opportunity. And yeah, that's going to do it. So uh, this is going to be Dactron signing out.